Hello there! In today's video we will see 5 interesting ideas about what we can make from simple drinking straws. Let's begin! And for the first idea we'll need a beaver, well really just a picture of it, or any other photo or painting that you'd like to hang in your bedroom, but can't be bothered to make or buy a frame for it. So our straws will help us with that. Usually two straws is enough for this kind of thing, but we're going to use four, to frame not only the upper and lower parts, but the sides too. Shall we begin? We see that our picture is 14 cm, so we measure out 14 on the straw and cut. Do that two times. Next, using scissors and a knife, we make a long cut at the side of the straw. And lastly, add a bit more strength to the picture by cutting and fixing two more straws for the sides. And when we have all the parts, let's begin assembling. Now just pass a thread and all done. All done! Now we can place our beaver… oh. To avoid this kind of thing, we can add a few drops of super glue or hot glue. Let's go to the next idea. For this one, we will need a glue gun and about six straws. And we'll be making a cell phone stand. First, bend two straws in half. Then, using a glue gun, connect them to each other at a 90 degrees angle or so. When the glue sets, add another 2 to 3 straws on which the phone itself will be laying on. To be sure, add another line of glue. Now we fix the footing and our phone stand is done. For our next idea, we'll need a straw and preferably smaller scissors, because the bigger ones don't fit that well and will not go smoothly inside of a straw of this particular size. Let's start, all we have to do is cut our tube in a spiral lengthwise. Hold on, so we got some nice material for cable management. This is our cable winding, and if you want to try using more than one straw, let's make and wind another one. And more like a bonus, a hiking stash, for guys and girls to safe keep a bit of sugar or emergency matches, shaving cream or face lotion in small amounts. This one is pretty easy, we take our pliers and press the straw, leaving a bit of plastic exposed. Then, using a lighter, we make the first plug. Next, we measure the needed length, depending on what and how much of it we want to store, and cut. We will try to seal some sugar in our capsule. And like the first time, we seal the other side. We get such a waterproof and pretty nice looking thing. And for the last and in my opinion the best idea from the bunch, we will need a straw and a couple of tools. We are going to make a DIY flute. First, using pliers, we take one side of the straw so that the edge of the metal is on the same level as the straw. Then press it as hard as we can. Next, go down a level and press again, the harder the better. After that, we take our scissors and cut away a bit of plastic. So we should get these trapezoids. If there's no sound at all or something's not right, try cutting the straw like this. Now, using a knife, we make two shallow cuts, going by the marks from the pliers. And it's important for the cuts to be in line. This is how our blank should look. All that's left is to make a couple of holes at equal distances from one another. We can do it like this. And don't make the first hole too close to the edge. Hold down, our flute is ready! Mm -hmm. 
Well guys, today we built a cell phone stand, a picture frame, DIY flute and something to tidy up our wires. Thank you very much for your attention, subscribe to our channel, leave a comment, like how our flute is really called. And have a great day everybody! See you in the next one, bye!